mostly. <laughs> What's Tampa Bay getting? Getting a great, great goalie, yeah. even better guy. Uh, so he's gonna be missed in uh, in Nashville, but uh, yeah, Tampa is gonna get a great goal. He's uh, he's young, he's a great team player, and uh, he's uh, he's still you know improving every year. And uh, I, I think he's gonna get a really good chance in uh, Tampa. Have you heard about the EA Sports stuff with Charlie Sheen? And how yeah. He's Campaign. What do you think about that? Oh, it's it's cool. I mean, I, I don't really know how uh, how that all happened, but uh, I'm sure that brought a lot of a lot of votes for me. And it's uh, it was pretty pretty cool. Once I once I read about it, it's, uh, I was kind of laughing. I'm like, hey, what's uh, what's going on here? But uh, it was uh, it's great. Uh, it's been a great experience that the whole campaign and. Uh, the you know involvement that everybody has kind of stepped up and uh, uh, all the fans, our fans as well in, in Nashville and uh, and uh, people in Finland too. So it's uh, it's been great. Do you play the game? And if you do, are you any good? Yeah, I, I do play the game. I I, I don't know. I don't want to I don't want to pump my tires too much, but. Uh, <laughs> Not bad. I, uh, no, it's uh, I usually play with my with my friends back home, and, and uh, it's just for for fun, pretty serious fun though. And uh, it's uh, but uh, yeah, I enjoy the game. I, I I'm probably not the best player, but I'm I'm alright. You play as Nashville. Sometimes actually, I just I just had a little oh, first first touch to the uh, NHL 2013. I, I played. I was playing Nashville, and one of their guys were playing uh, Detroit, and uh, I, I, be, I beat him 2-1, so I was, uh, I was pretty happy. I'm already here, I scored first shot, like 26 seconds into the game. That was, Can you talk about your, I mean, everyone around says you have the best club hand in the world. And do you find, do you work on it? Is there something special or trick to get, just to get so good with your club? I don't know if it's. Uh, I, I think it's just. I, I, I just use it so much. Uh, yeah, sometimes I probably overuse it. Sometimes even too much. And uh, but I, I think that just uh, comes naturally to me. And uh, I, I I work on it every 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 single day in practice. And uh, I think that's just the. Uh, I I really don't think about it too much. It comes naturally, and uh, uh, it's. Uh, but yeah, for sure, it helps my game a lot. Yeah, yeah, and Lankers too. I mean, it's uh, yeah, two great goalies. I'm I'm in a really good company here, and uh, yeah, congrats to Quick, uh, Con Smite and Stanley Cup. Uh, that's an amazing year. And, uh, so and Longquist too. I, that's that. He, he's their New York Rangers back home. Uh, they 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 have a they have a good team, but uh, you know he's he's the guy. That he's he's the backbone for their team, and so uh, yeah, really really good goalies, and I, I'm honored to be sitting here and being uh, being nominated. It seems like until after July 1, Ryan Suter's name man dominates the landscape for you guys in Nashville. Have you had a chance to talk to him much, kind of gauge where his food is, or try, oh. to, try to sell the city back on him? I don't think I need to sell the city. I, I mean, he, he's been there for longer than I have, and uh, he knows all the ins and outs of, of Nashville. And, I, I know that he loves he loves the team he loves the loves the city I I know it's boring to hear but uh, that's uh, as a team I do try to be uh, just supportive and uh, try to uh, stay in touch and kind of you know just believe and believe in uh, organization that everything is gonna be taken care of and uh, the good thing will happen but uh, I, uh, you know I really don't know what, what else to say. Wait, do you call him? I mean, I know he's out this farm. He's like basically. Yeah, I don't think I, I don't think he has even uh, any connection on his on his farm. Uh, it's so far away. So. Uh, he's no, I, I haven't really uh, since uh, since I left Nashville. Haven't really talked with him too much, but uh, but uh, but I, I'm sure I'll I'll talk with him soon here. Do you get you you committed a lot to the franchise? Do you get nervous now that? 
if the two defensemen there might not be there for the time that you committed? Well, there's always a chance that you know some of your best players are not going to be there with you for the for the length of your your contract. But uh, yeah, absolutely. I think uh, you know those guys. They make me better. Uh, they they help my job uh, tremendously. And, no question about it. Uh, our whole defensive defensive lineup, uh, they 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 help me. But uh, especially those two guys, they are, they are our our best players, so for sure. But I don't I don't want to think like that too much. I don't want to I don't want to kind of already think that you know what what if they, right. they leave? It's it's part of the game, and uh, we we know a lot more after uh, beginning of July. Are you? Are you confident that Suter could come back? I mean, is that belief there that he that he still could do that? Yeah, obviously, he, I, I'm sure everybody would have liked to see uh, that happen, you know, yesterday. Right. Uh, but uh, but yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm confident there's uh, there's going to be a lot of attention on, on Suter, a lot of a lot of teams uh, interested. But uh, I, I still believe that Nashville has the uh, still the advantage with, uh, with all the all the, all the facts that we are still you know getting better I, I think we have a really good uh, core group of guys uh, I, I think uh, you know for him you know, can't really talk uh, you know what he thinks but uh, I know he, he likes it there he loves the city and uh, uh, the organization so uh, I, I still believe that we, we have a really good chance to play with him in the, in the future. What does, um, sorry, yeah. what does the run the Kings win over? Sorry, real quick. They want to move him over with the EA stuff. They just want to get that it can happen. And even if you go in as an AC, you get good goaltending, you can, this can happen. Yeah, and uh, you know, you get good everything. I mean, the, the whole whole team played really well. And the quick was obviously a gun smite winner, but uh, uh, yeah, it tells it tells a lot. I, I think that's that's been the trend the last few years. Uh, this uh, you know whoever makes the playoffs, I, I believe that everybody has a chance to a chance to win the Stanley Cup. And uh, it uh, you know once you, if, if you if your team gets hot, if you get hot, uh, you know it's uh, it's a short whole season, and uh, when thing, things go on your way, anything is possible. And uh, but it's a, it's a good it's a great example for. Any other team in, in the league and uh, a team like us too. Uh, thank you. You're you're a pretty quiet guy most of the time and don't try to attract a lot of attention. What do you think about all the outpouring and support that you've gotten for the for the cover? Oh, it's uh, it's uh, it was almost overwhelming, uh, but it's been great. I, I think uh, I think that's uh, that's a little bit different. Uh, it's gone. I try to take it as a as a fun thing and like it is. Uh, it's a, it's a great fun and and, uh, and uh, but it was uh, it was pretty cool to see how much uh, how many fans got involved and uh, it didn't matter what city people across the across the uh, United States across in, in Europe uh, Canadian people were voting and it's uh, it was pretty cool to see. I wasn't expecting that. Uh, I was really surprised that attention that the whole whole thing received. What do you think it would mean for the franchise to have one of its players on the cover of the uh, I don't know, it's hard to say anything to that, but uh, obviously for my, I can only talk, I, I'm sure it's, uh, it's a, it would mean a lot to the whole organization, the city of Nashville, it would be, uh, I'm sure the fans would be, it would be kind of proud, proud thing for, for the fans and uh, for myself too, it would be kind of uh, amazing, amazing thing because, uh, you know, you always, Look at the covers. You play the game when you're growing up, and uh, there's always the game's best stars on the cover. And uh, so that's uh, it's almost overwhelming, but it's, uh, it's pretty cool. And you need some to get to the finals. You need some pretty significant players too. Are you surprised that your candidacy beat Henrik Lundqvist? Yeah. Uh, I was uh, sorry. I was. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Uh, yeah, I was a little bit surprised. There were some good players that uh, uh, 
our fans beat <laughs> along the way. It's not it's not really me. The people who voted they uh, they helped me uh, all the way to the finals. So that's the that's the biggest thing. Uh, I need to thank all the other people who, who, who who's been voting me. And, um, so, but yeah, I was I was a little bit surprised. I knew that every single round it was tight. Uh, it, it was never it was never you know really easy for me or anything like that. But, uh, Every, every round was, was tight and uh, uh, I'm sure it's going to be like that with the final round too. Culture, good player in the league. Can you just talk about how talented he is? Oh, he's, uh, he's a great talent. Uh, luckily we don't play against them too often so uh, we don't get to see him too many times. But uh, yeah, one of, the, one of the most exciting players the last time I feel like in the game. Uh, really, really skilled player, sees the ice really well. and. Uh, He's, uh, he's the leader of uh, uh, Philly right now. Shea nominated for the Norris again. Seems like he may be favored to win the award. Can you talk about his um, candidacy for that and as a captain of the Predators? Oh, he's, uh, he, he de deserves that for sure. And, uh, uh, I, I truly think he should win. And I hope he, he will. Uh, uh, he's, uh, he's against against some good players but uh, you know he had a he had a great year too and, but he's yeah he's our captain and uh, our leader he's uh, I've been lucky enough to play with him uh, uh, some years now and uh, every year he, he gets better and, uh, it's the same thing with Sudo too and they uh, those two it's hard, it's hard, always hard to talk about just one guy one guy and they compensate each other so well but uh, but yeah Shay Shea is our leader and uh, he's the He's the he's one of the top uh, top defensemen in the league. Okay. What in your time in Nashville, you've seen the the fan base has always been good, but it's kind of become a known nationally, and now voting you into the top two. What does that say about the Nashville fans now that they're getting recognition elsewhere? Uh, I think it speaks volumes. Uh, it's uh, it tells a lot about our fans. They uh, you know they they are get they are being recognized more and more every year and. Uh, it's, it goes hand in hand with uh, with the with the way we play. We, we you know we get we get better. Our, our fans get more involved, uh, and uh, I, I think that's uh, they deserve that. Uh, it's uh, it's a great thing for our city and our organization that we are getting more uh, publicity and or, uh, getting recognized. And, uh, yeah, it's a it's a for me it's a big thank you to our fans to you know. Put me, put me in this position, and uh, especially with the EA Sports cover, uh, the finals is great. But how does this year's trip to Las Vegas differ from last year's as far as preparation and knowing what to expect and everything? Uh, a little bit different. This year, uh, you know what to expect a little bit more, and uh, uh, but still, the biggest thing is just try to enjoy it. I, I mean, we don't, we don't really have that many things to do that we are gonna. On, on our schedule, we, you know, this today we meet the media, and, and tomorrow is the gala. And, uh, a few things with the EA Sports, so, but mostly it's just vacation and uh, try to enjoy the, enjoy this uh, great city and uh, have some fun. Thank you.